Hey guys, in this HTML tutorial, I'm going to show you how to make your background images fit the screen. First, I'm going to add an image to my body tag using the style attribute. So I'm going to use the background CSS property with URL and parenthesis. And I'm going to type the actual file name of my background image. So that's how you usually apply a background to your HTML page. The problem here, of course, if you stretch the width of the browser, you will see this tile effect, which is like a wallpaper. What you're looking for is the CSS property called background size. By default, it's unset, and that's why it's producing the actual image size in your wallpaper pattern. By setting it to 50%, you're going to reduce the entire image by 50% in the entire pattern. You can also use contain, which is probably what you're looking for, Contain will fit your image into the screen based on the screen height. So I'm going to go ahead and apply that to our actual example. Background size, contain. Uh, you should try out with your own image and your own screen size. And you might produce slightly different results based on your screen and image size. There's still one problem with this is that the image is still repeating and sometimes it goes off screen like this. But you can fix that by applying background repeat property with a no repeat value. So I'll go ahead and add that in my editor. The background dash repeat with a no repeat value. It's going to remove the tile effect and we'll end up with just one image. I don't know what case exactly you're looking for, but another thing you can do is set background size to 100, and it's going to pretty much do something like this. This is a very common technique for setting a background image. And basically, that's exactly the same thing what the background size cover value does. It stretches your entire image across the entire width. You could have used either 100% or cover. So if I changed 100% for the background size property to cover, nothing is actually going to change because they appear to be ex doing exactly the same thing. And this is probably the effect you're looking for if you want to stretch your entire image across the entire screen in an HTML document. Thanks guys for watching my HTML how to make background image fit the screen tutorial. And I'll see you in my next tutorial.